Do you ever wonder what happens when the police leave? Crime Scene Cleaners are private companies that handle the cleanup after the police are gone. Spalding Decon is one of the nation's largest cleanup companies handling the aftermath of homicides, suicides, decompositions, hoarding, and much more. These are our stories. Uh, we're in the known assassin today, helping a guy who's a musician and also a hoarder. He's accumulated 12 years worth of just, he will even say it's trash. It's basically this whole way through. So you're not, you're not clearing any of this? He doesn't want us to. I don't know how he uses the toilet. Okay. But it ain't that. And if it is that, ain't nothing getting flushed. Hey, this is Fiona with Spalding. Uh, we're in the known assassin today, helping a guy who's a musician and also a hoarder. He's accumulated 12 years worth of just, he will even say it's trash. So we're just here helping him. A little difficult. Uh, just because he's present and he wants to go through everything, but we've got all hands on deck today So we're making really good progress today. We've got me Daddy long legs Nico and Rebecca the new girl. So we're introducing Nico and Rebecca into Basically how to do a hoard. The first time since so. the holiday, right? Yeah, it's their Yeah, so they're like second hoard. It's almost equivalent to the holiday giveaway as in the amount off trash that's in there. He also had a water leak, so there's a substantial amount of mold pretty much on everything. So not only are we doing the hoard itself, but we're also pulling his carpet to help dry out his place. But we're only touching one bedroom and then the bathroom, kitchen, living room, dining room. He but wants you to leave one bath or one bedroom alone? He doesn't want us to touch that one bedroom and that one bedroom looks the worst, to be honest with you. Did he say why? I believe that's the one he sleeps in. He's doing a lot better now than he was earlier. Earlier, it was almost like at a standstill because he needed to see everything that we were doing. I think he's getting more comfortable with us now, so it's flowing a lot better. Are you guys doing a deep clean of stuff too, or are you just getting the trash out? Just getting the trash out, pulling up the carpet, and then putting some air movers and dehues to just dry it out, and get rid of the mold for him. I'm feeling great, bro. Enjoying your peanut butter crackers? Every day, it's giving me life, though. It ain't giving me life, man. You need my protein, you feel me? I sure do. How's this horde treating you? Dude's actually really cool. You know what I mean? Dude's super cool. Seemed like an eclectic dude, though. I like it that he plays all these instruments. He's a lot better than he was the other day, which is cool. I don't know if he had a good night's yeah, sleep. Better. You know what I mean? But he's, he's a lot better. He's more talkative. Very opinionated, but still nice, you know what I mean? Doesn't want you calling him sir. Yeah, you don't want me calling him sir, but People gotta understand, that's just who I am as a person. You know, I grew up in Nashville, Tennessee, Russellville, Kentucky. So my parents, my mom and dad, to this day, if they didn't hear me call somebody, yes ma'am, no ma'am, yes sir, no sir, that's a punch in the face, automatic, right off the rip. Just straight punch in the mouth, what'd you say? Good job they all tall so they can reach. Oh yeah, so my mom didn't <laughs> play no games. So for all you moms out there that don't play no games about this, yes sir, no sir, no ma'am, yes ma'am, Keep doing that, smack them in the face. Well, you know, we don't want to necessarily promote <laughs> punching your kid in the no, face. No, smack. But... Smack is a different. <laughs> a little, uh, just tell him it's a love tap. Let me just tell him it's a love tap. Okay. <laughs> well, we at Spalding yeah. Decon don't necessarily condone love taps, but. Yeah, we condone love taps. <laughs> Parents love you. They love you. My name is Thaddeus Key. They I love peanut butter you. crackers, yeah. slapping kids, and not. Yeah, bro. And calling and people sir. Ma'am and sir. That's right. So hey, you got, you're going to punch some all Pokemon this, goers? No, all, no, I'm just wondering for all those fans that keep talking shit about me not liking Pokemon goers. You can go screw yourself, you know? I can give you a love tap, how about that? <laughs> all my Tetris, Miss Pac-Man people, Gallagher. You Gallagher? Know? Yeah, all that Gallagher? stuff. Gallagher? Gallagher, Gallagher. That's, uh, that's, uh, <laughs> that's, that's Gallagher's sister, Gallagher. All do Pokemon Go losers, God almighty. Just find, like, like get a destination and all of you guys get together and get lost again. How about that? It's such a hill to die on. <laughs> Tetris don't make you do that. You know, I, I can sit here and play with this door right here and play Tetris like it's nobody's business. 
I sit there and do a jumping jack and play Tetris. Oh, it's level fucking, you know, 400. Yeah. Tetris is, is, is multitask oh, uh, efficient. See what I'm saying? Talking about these Pokemon people made me drop my phone in here. I hate them. <laughs> The TV. TV's, TV's dead. dead. Okay. DVD players that's on top of the TV? Gone. All right. Now it is. What about your VHS players? Uh, let it go. All right. Okay, you say you play the most, you think? Uh, drums and, uh, jazz, actually. Yeah. How long have you been playing drums? Oh. Nine years old? Yeah. Well, you're pretty damn good. Yeah. You're not well, you're probably pretty damn good. Well, I've played with a lot of quality uh, players. Uh, I've played the, the rock and roll, the, uh, the funk, the jazz, the top 40, the show band. Grab those phones and phone nice. Blues, just about everything. That's good. That's how you do that. That's how you do that. This t the box TV goes. This? Yes, the, the small TV goes, the modern TV stays. That, that's right here, Trent? That's, that's, that works, so it stays. Take your time, you want to do whatever. Oh, yeah. yeah. Those chairs right there. The boxes with the cushions stay. More drop seat. Yeah, that was the ones that you okay. just gave me. All right. I just moved them. I'm just going to set them on top of this microwave. Yeah, I don't know if we're good. Mike, can I keep this bag? It's brand new. I can't see with lights in my eyes. Oh, sorry, man. No, that goes away. Put this box right behind you. Mm-hmm. Right beside of me. This is my little old page. This is my little old page. Therapeutic. Huh? Everything you want to go through here, or you want to just take it as is? We could take it as is. It looks like trash. It does look like CDs. trash. Um, and that's it. And cigarettes. Yeah. Actually, this CD can go, but... Uh, you can just leave it there. I'll take it as is on here. Oh, well, yeah? I got big bucks? <laughs> Something like that. I know there's a quarters collection, but uh, there's Nico, an arrow. Uh, right to the... Like, look in between your legs, look below you. Like, look right there. Aha! <laughs> If you don't want us to do that bedroom today, we can at least finish off this living area, at least get this carpet pulled. I can cut it right at the hallway. Great. I mean, we can deal with this bedroom over here if, if you'd like. It's up to you. If you, what, how about we do the living room? Once we're done with the living room, see how you feel. If you want us to go for the bedroom, we can. Great. If not, we can just. Yes, let's do that. All what right. you just said. Sounds good, Mike. How you feeling today, Nico? It's going good. It's going good. We got a lot of, a lot of stuff out today. Um, I think all we have to do in the living room is pull out some carpet. Is this your first hoard since the holiday giveaway? I don't know. <laughs> all my days mesh with school and everything. <laughs> ah, what are you going to school for? Criminal justice. Nice. Is, yeah. that, is that why you wanted this kind of job? Kind of get an insight? Yeah. I'm going to school for criminal justice. Ever since I was a kid, I wanted to become a cop, so it's my goal. Got to have that stick control fee. That yeah. stick control. And, and that one, like I say, is advanced techniques. So you start with the stick control, then you go yeah. to the advanced techniques book. Then, and then I played the cello. Oh, that's more difficult than drums. Found out I have really good hands. Yes, yes cello, yeah. that's, that's really hard there. Agree. Given a snare drum. I used to listen to like drums and then just sit with my headphones on and just try it. And... That's the best way to do it. Yeah. And just let your body do what it does. Yeah. Don't worry about left or right or 
And it's a, and it's a rule. That's what I go by. I let my body do what it does. Right. In life. Hey, no, no, <laughs> seriously. It just does, kept growing. Man. It just kept growing to six, seven, <laughs> do whatever you do. Right. It can help it's you in life. life. You go to a concert, you can still see the band. Dude, I can see the band. I don't have to worry about going to VIP. I'm looking right over everyone. Especially all those Pokemon people. I look right over them. Right. Right over Okay. Uh, it's basically this whole way through. So you're not you're not clearing any of this? He doesn't want us to. Yo, he climbed through this morning. The door was wide open and no one was answering. And then he started answering and he climbed this way. Are you working hard or hardly working? Is this your first uh, hoarding job since the holiday giveaway? Since the holiday, yep. Alright, how does it compare to that? Um, he seems more like he wants to give it up. I know Hollis had a lot of trouble, but um, he seems more like he's ready to get rid of stuff and move on, which is positive. We love having you, and Fiona loves having another uh, European here. British invasion. That's right. <laughs> I just got a burst of energy, I just wanted to just do some stuff. <laughs> you know, I wanted to do something to play it backwards. <laughs> you play anything? No. How'd so, it go today? Not bad. We made uh, a lot of progress. So I know it's a lot for him, but we did the whole kitchen, living room, dining room. So when we come back, it's literally just that little part of the hallway and the one bedroom to do. You're not and doing the, the bathroom? In the bathroom, I think, if he if he wants us to. He's up in the air on what he wants us to do with that. So we came so. to a stopping point today just because he wanted to take a break? Yeah, got a little bit too much for him today, so he wanted to stop. Just put it at a standstill for the day. He just needs to recoup and just get situated with his new open floor plan. Good. So, okay. we'll be All back, right. so I'm out. See you next time. We're on day two? It's just gonna be a longer day today because there's a lot more stuff to go through that he hasn't gone through at all. Where are we hoping to get done by the end of today? The bedroom. Only thing that stays is uh, the furniture. Truthfully, I haven't been able to really look at the bed just yet, but he wants to keep the bed. Plumber's on his way to fix the toilet. I don't know how he uses the toilet, okay. but it ain't that. And if it is that, ain't nothing getting flushed. Dude, I don't think Aquaman can fix, fix yeah. that toilet. <laughs> you know now me and Thad. Toilet experts. Yes, we are. And as soon as you remove that toilet, like, everything's gonna go. I don't really wanna be there for when that toilet gets removed. I do. To be honest with you. You can be there. That'd be a good you shot. You can be there. You help the plumber that's gonna be pouring out of that and the smell's gonna be horrendous. I can't wait. Well, maybe there's more. Wait a second. When did it expire? 1999. What'd you guys see? Brown recluse? Yeah. Yeah, it was pretty big. It was, it was, mm -mm. Where was it? On the mattress. On the mattress. Yeah. Which he said he's had a couple spider bites before. That's yeah, not good. but nothing like that. He was like, I would have remembered a brown recluse <laughs> It's like a it, like film, like an overcast over the carpet, all over the trash. But on top of that, it's just like somebody pulled a three liter, you know, a water. Oil. And just, water. yeah, and just, and just left it there for years. Like the whole house is just. But think about it, good. it's toilet water yeah, it's, that leaked out. Yeah, it's not good. Dinosaurs? <laughs> Could be. <laughs> Prehistoric. Pokemon Go? Uh, could residue of. Hold on. Pokemon Go Goers. They've been here. So it wasn't me playing. It was him playing. Uh, I was going to say. <laughs> see if it's keepable or not. If it actually resembles a musical instrument anymore. What happened with that room? 
that's just where all the musical equipment went when I would switch jobs. See, I played a variety of different instruments. Yeah, when yeah. I switch instruments, throw the, the ones in there and pull out the other ones that I'm going to use. Yeah. I have three drum sets, five guitars, four timbales, four bongos. Just. I lived on the road for so long that once I got a place of my own, I started hoarding because I could. Instead of living out of a suitcase and a van. Those plumbing people don't look like they want to do anything today. Like if you chose to have a job with toilets, expect to deal with shit. Absolutely. Don't think that you're ready to pull a fucking cell phone out of the no. thing every it's, time. It's just a different toilet, same shit. The other plumber said they can send somebody out tomorrow. Okay. Okay. So satisfying. Which part? Just the getting it all in one piece and stuff. Mm. About that floor. Yeah, so new. Yeah. Wait a minute, is that the dancing gopher from Caddyshack? Yes, it is. Oh, I used to have that same animatronic. Oh, it doesn't work anymore. I'm it's, sure it doesn't work anymore. I'm sure there's batteries somewhere. I swear to God, that's like straight from my childhood. That's so crazy. I didn't see that coming. Oh my shit, that's kind of cool. Yeah. Hey, you find the best things in a yard sale. For real. I, I mean, it's terrifying, but it's cool. Right, it's a little creepy. Especially since it's and all that stuff. Uh, exactly. Come out towards me. What are you going to do? Breathe, wake <laughs> up, see another day. Yep. Be blessed and thankful. You're great, brother. I'm just glad we could be here to help, be some well, assistance I'm to you. It's sure. a lot better, you know, than what it was. You're so one you can step be closer to that. getting everything, you know. One in, bit at a time. In theory, that's true, yes. One bit at a time. Finish uh, lifting the laundry. Yeah, that washing machine is no joke. And it actually was like loaded with clothes, like so there was trash at the top, and uh, there was clothes at the bottom of it, like wet clothes. So. Was it leaking? There's a bunch of water in there, or is that just from the? Just from turning off the pipes. Oh, okay. It drained out. We put it in a bucket, but it was starting to spray from what was in the line. Gross. Gonna go in and uh, sweep up, put his bed back in the bedroom for him and uh, see what else he wants us to do and after that we're done for the day. I think we did quite well today. Crushed it. He was able to handle more than two hours, which is good. Uh, does this compare to uh, any of your recent hordes you've been on? I mean, it's really like a four or a five, to be honest with you, living condition wise, um, and the amount of damage from literally floor to ceiling uh, that's damaged from, what, roof leak, I think he said, mm -hmm. plus the toilet issue. This one was probably the wettest hoard that I've done. Um, most hoards is just like chaos. This one, it was just, it was just wet. Heavy, wet, slimy, and, and just roaches. Um, Tell them how you really feel about it. <laughs> it's eye-opening to see that someone actually lives in these conditions that's the one thing that never seems like i'm always amazed by it every hard we do mm -hmm. i'm always like how do they live this way you know and then i go to the next one and it's like how do you live this way but they do so i'm happy we're able to help i know he appreciates it absolutely i know he he may not come off as super appreciative right now it's kind of like he's holding his ego and his pride aside but for me it's about a level four you know like she was saying you know, the amount of dampness and wetness as far as on the walls, floor. So all the roaches and bugs and stuff like that really are like, this is their heaven. Yeah. So, you know, to get that up out of, you know, that apartment, 
so he can, you know, have some type of condition to walk around and, you know, at least try to sleep and get it taken care of. Step by step, he's going to be able to knock it out. So I'm just glad we can be of some assistance to him, put a little dent in it for him, so that way we can get him a lot closer to his ultimate goal, and that's to not be a hoarder anymore. Yeah. Right now, he's got that rustic industrial look with the concrete floor going on. Yeah. <laughs> so. Not popping. So we're good. Another one down. Nice. You can't use that. That's hers. Wait, you did you, it. You're trying you know, to I steal it at the it same too. time. We got it. You feel me? <laughs> you just stole a cone. I, what, what, this is this is from weeks ago. I've been wanting a cone. He really I was has. Like, Man, uh, I was like all the other drivers, they get to put cones out on the road. I'm, I'm gonna take my own cone. So whoever's missing a cone from whatever business you are, thank you. Appreciate the early <laughs> Christmas gift. So what all are we doing today, Fee? So today we're doing a deep clean uh, of the best that we can. Limited space to work with, but Rebecca's done cleaned the walls. I've been focusing on the kitchen and the fridge. Nico's doing the bathroom. So. Right. What all are we trying to get done by the end of today? Uh, we're trying to get as much cleaned as possible to the best that it can be cleaned. How are we doing, so. Nico? Good, good, good. Got a haircut? I did. Oh, hi. <laughs> I look fresh. <laughs> yeah, you do. How long have you been in here? Probably like three, three and a half hours. Oh, in this one room? Just in the bathroom. Holy shit. Yep. Because the room is so thick. And the bath soap that uh, I've been using the scraper to get it off. So, especially to get these walls like this. If you remember what it looked like before, but we're getting there. Good sloshy sound. Today we're back to do a deep clean. He was able to get uh, his new toilet replaced. In the midst of getting his new toilet, uh, he realized that the washer dryer water valves were leaking and rotted out. So he had to get new ones of those. And while they were replacing those, they found out that his hot water heater was leaking. All morning, the entire apartment has been flooding like non-stop like within minutes like you're standing in a puddle it made the the job itself more work because it was difficult to focus on cleaning while you know trying to suck up all the water so it didn't cause more water damage the main focus today was cleaning the kitchen the bathroom and the walls from all the walls he's not ready for us to go to the second bedroom yet but it will be coming back at some point to do the mold so that second bedroom is definitely going to have to get addressed. At the end of all of this, his place is literally going to be brand new. He's pretty overwhelmed. I think he's about to be done for the day, to be honest with you. But we've made a lot of progress. I'm happy with the work that we've done today. You can definitely see a difference. So that's good. I am messing up no floors. Oh, that's pretty. Good job, Nico. I don't know if it looked that good when I moved in. Don't recognize it? No, I thought I walked in the neighbor's house for a second. <laughs> Thank you very much. You're welcome. I'll see you Monday. We'll go from there. All right. How'd today go? I'm so hungry. It's not even funny. I think today went well. Went well. Went well. Our bathroom looks probably the best it's ever looked, along with the kitchen. Everything that can be cleaned got cleaned. We, uh, Everything starts working out in his favor and his spirits get up high again. But yeah, so until next time. See you guys. Thanks for watching, guys. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and ring that bell to be notified of the next episode. For more information, visit any of our locations.